Welcome to downtown Halabadu. Last known resting place, the Tusk of Ganesh. Spectacular. Hmm. And what? Doesn't it look like there's a dam or something between the two Ganesh statues? Must have been eroded by the falls. So how do we get in? Hang on. Yeah. Look at the crown. It's not wear and tear. You're right. Maybe it was a watchtower. Bet that's how the Persians got in. I have heard about this place for so long. <laughs> I can't believe I'm actually looking at it. You should take a picture. Send it to your dad. Great idea. What? You're one of those cultures who can't work a computer? Just take the picture. Show it to him in person then. No, it's uh, just a few decades too late for that. Look, I'm... Oh. Oh, God, please, no. It's fine. <laughs> Shall we, uh, head over to Halabadu? Hard to believe it's real. Imagine what it took to make this. The craftsmen, the engineers. Yeah. Their work still stands. But they're gone. Maybe their king should have used their wealth to protect his people and not make such an inviting target. On the stairs down. What's left of them anyway? Okay. Ready? You good? <laughs> for a way up. See some structures beneath the falls. You're right. Awesome. Asking me that, it'll save us both some time if you just assume it's not. Ah! 
Oh, oh, shit. Oh. oh boy. It's definitely not safe, by the way. I saw. Think you can get back up here? Yeah. Keep going. I'll catch up. because you said, please. I didn't, actually. Once you said Ganesh was the remover of obstacles. He's more than happy to place him in your way if he thinks he'll benefit. That why the horse and I chose him for Halibadu? He's also the lord of good fortune, the one you pray to for prosperity and success. Got it. That's cool. Really, the only way across. Yep. Ugh. You having fun out there? You know it. Good way or bad way? I'll let you know. You're doing great, China. Thanks. I'll be doing better when we get to the farm. Surprised we haven't seen Saab yet. Knock on wood. Oh, he's around. Doubt we'll see him up here. Why is that? He doesn't have the stones to climb this high. <laughs> I think I see a place we could swing over to the crown. Just a little farther to go. Worth it? Oh, impressive. Yeah. Oh. Now, how do we get off this thing? Okay. Easy does it. Are you going to be back here? Mm-hmm. 
All right. Feels more sturdy up here. No jinxes. <laughs> Is our way in, courtesy of the Persian army. <coughs> wow, <coughs> nice shot. The Persians must have had a trebuchet. Trebuchet? Can't you just say catapult like a normal person? It can handle heavier projectiles, like this one, and fling them longer distances. Right. You learned that in your military training? I looked it up on Wikipedia. Like a normal person. Ready? After you. Incredible. It's our old friends, Harashirama and Ganesh. Friends? Looks like they're fun. Well, when the Hindu gods aren't off fighting demons, they're sometimes fighting each other. Ganesh isn't even armed. I guess it's not really his style. Amazing. Did they just carve this whole place out of the mountain? Sure looks like it. They barricaded the door. Didn't do them much good. Guess they didn't expect the Persians to drop in from above. You'd think after two prior invasions they'd be prepared for anything. Or they just never thought they'd be defeated. Through here. Right behind you. Hey, look. Armaments. You were right, Nadine. I have my moments. This all Persian? Uh, looks to be a mix of Persian and Hoysala. First line of defense. Now we're getting somewhere. Hey! Another one of these doors. Now let's see. Oh, good. This one actually works. There we go. Nice to get some light. Feels like a crypt in here. Crypts and burials aren't really a Hindu thing. They generally favor cremation. It's a beautiful ceremony, Antiyishti, Sanskrit for last sacrifice. Sacrifice? The idea is our bodies are merely borrowed vehicles and you're returning it so that others might benefit. It's a lovely sentiment. Too late for these poor bastards. Hey, up here. What the hell? Jesus. This was it. Their final stand. Oh, wasn't enough to save their empire. But... Their loss is our gain. Here's our way in. Nadine, can you lend a hand with this chap? Sure. Come on, old fella. There we go. Excuse me. 
Excuse me. <coughs> Sorry. We must be getting close. Hopefully closer than these guys. This device looks familiar. Let's hope it doesn't turn on the water in here. Oh. Well, that's different. What is all this? If I had a guess, I'd say it's some kind of lock mechanism to open that door. Okay, on the left, we have Shiva gifting Parashurama the axe, and on the right, we have Parashurama chopping off Ganesha's tusk. Wait, with the axe? Yeah. The one that Shiva, Ganesha's father, gave to Parashurama? Yeah. Hush. It's messed up. That's family. <laughs> Come on, let's see about opening that door. So how does all this work? Oh, uh, only one way to find out. Let's see what this does. All right, that slid the piece away from me. It's shadow move too. Let's try this. Over you go. I see what's happening. The shadows match the mural. Right. So let's see if I can line them all up. This actually looks like fun.
got an idea. Salah and the tiger. Here we go. Fingers crossed. That's supposed to happen? I don't know. Just don't get us killed. You're no fun. Ready? <laughs> 